so I only really found what I think is my style a few months ago as recently and you know throughout my photographic journey so far I've always been looking at other people's work and thinking about that I should be doing what they're doing and not looking what I'm doing and I do like the work I've been producing but I've mostly been thinking you know is it as good as that person's or you know can I relate to it in a way that that person can relate to their work and you know now I've realized that I've been doing that all wrong and I need to be shooting what I love and what I really enjoy um, so this these past few months I've really found that and honed that and I'm so much more happier and I'm looking at just what I'm doing and I'm still acknowledging other people's work but in a way that will benefit me instead of just like really bring me down because um, I think it's really hard in such a creative space to be unique and feel unique um, but it comes with time and I think there should be less pressure on people and students to find their own style because I think it really does take time um, and it's an important skill to learn and it's important to look at other people's work but in a way that's not gonna have a negative impact on you and the way you see yourself and the way you look at your work um, and that's all really I've just also found things and subjects that I'm really passionate about shooting and working with and talking to and I think that's a really important thing when you have a lot more creative freedom to work within. Um, yeah, so I think I still don't really know, I couldn't really explain what my style is, but I'm just still very much trying out everything and just trying to have my own mark on my work and feel really proud of what I'm putting out.